Hello everybody and welcome back to Novaero. Today in this video we will be discussing what is meant by etox. But before I start with the video, if you are new to our channel, I would request you to subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon so that you don't miss any further videos. So first of all, let us begin with what ETOPS stands for. ETOPS is an acronym for Extended Range Twin Engine Operation. According to ECAO, all the airlines which support twin engine aircraft operating over long distances must have an extended range twin engine operation policy, procedure or approval. This means that twin engine aircrafts are not normally allowed to operate for more than 60 minutes single engine flying time from a suitable alternate airfield. So, the purpose of ETOPS regulations were to provide very high level of safety while facilitating the use of twin engines on flight routes, which were previously restricted to three or four engines airplanes. Therefore, ETOPS has now evolved as EDTO, which stands for Extended Diversion Time Operation, with an intent to avoid the diversion. Now, you must be thinking of what kind of diversion am I talking about? To understand better, you must know these two definitions, diversion airports and threshold time. A diversion airport is an airport capable of handling the ETOPS rated aircraft during an emergency landing and whose flying distance is at the point of emergency shall not exceed the ETOPS diversion period of that airport. Threshold time is the range stated in time defined by the state of operator to an en route alternate aerodrome beyond which the state of operator must obtain EDTO approval. So, when the diversion time exceeds the threshold time, the operation is considered to be an extended diversion time operation. Now, ICAO has coined the acronym ETOPS for twin engine aircraft operation further than one hour from a diversion airport at one engine inoperative cruise speed over water or land on route which were previously restricted to three or four engine aircrafts. Therefore, ECAO replaced ETOPS with EDTO with the main reason to better reflect the scope and applicability of the new standards. According to DGCA, the threshold time for EDTO is 60 minutes for scheduled operators and for two engine airplanes with maximum seating capacity of more than 19 passengers and maximum all-up weight more than 45,360 kgs. And the threshold time for a non-scheduled operator operating two engine airplane with maximum seating capacity of 19 or less passengers and maximum all-up weight less than 45,360 kgs is 90 minutes. Whereas the threshold time for more than two engine airplanes is 120 minutes. However, this rule can be elevated for operators who can demonstrate equal reliability. A suitably approved aircraft can operate routes, taking it up to 207 minutes single engine flying time from an airport making both transatlantic and transpacific flights feasible. So I hope that you find this video informative. Share it with your friends to help them understand better. 